Hello everyone, today's cue card is describe a long walk you ever had. Now in this cue card or in this video, I have discussed two very important tips. So see the video till end and also I have shared some important vocab. Let's start with the simple answer without wasting the time. The question is describe a long walk you ever had and bullet points are when this happened, where you walked, who you were with, and explain how you felt about this walk. Now, here is my first tip. My first tip is that read the question very carefully because from this question, you came to know about the tenses which you need to speak in your answer. For example, if I talk about this bullet points, check out the verb happened. This is the second form of the verb. Then walked, then you were. And then felt. Felt is also the second form. So from these forms, you came to know about the tenses which you need to speak in your answer. And that should be passed because the forms are used in this questions and bullet points are passed. So definitely answer would also be in the past. OK, please read the question and bullet points very carefully. OK, let's move towards my simple answer. Before moving towards my simple answer, here is my tip number two, and that is you need to use your tenses, your present tenses in the journal line because journal lines are the background of the question and it is very important to speak these lines into the journal form because these are your routine things and routine things always comes with the present tenses. As I have used, I often go for it. So often go, go is the present form of the verb. So in the general line, there is no need to use the past tenses, whether the cue card is in the present, past or future. Always the present tenses would be used here. OK, Ho hope this tip is clear to you. OK, let's move towards the vocab. If I talk about these words, as you can see, simple words are also written here. But if you use the, the high level vocab, definitely your bands will going to improve a lot. For example, if you need to speak about the short trip, if you need to say that I went to a short trip last Sunday, instead of this word, you could say I went to a, I went to an excursion with my family. So try to learn the high level vocab. OK. OK, let's move towards the simple answer. Walking is an exercise which has lots of benefits. I love morning walk and I often go for it. Today, I would like to talk about a long walk, which I took few days ago. Last month, my family and I went to Jaipur. It was a short excursion. We stayed in our Royal Hotel. The view was amazing. Next morning, I decided to go for a morning walk to explore the new city. I got up around 5 a.m. and after finishing up, I started brisk walk. Instead of saying after finishing up, you could say after uh, finishing my after freshing up. It's not finishing up. Little bit type error here. Freshing up. Freshing. I was alone as other members of my family were so tired that they were sleeping. The weather was very cool and fresh. Jaipur is known as a pink city. So I was astonished to see everything in a pink color. The green grass, beauty of rising sun, blossoming flowers and chopping of birds. The peaceful environment encouraged me to walk more and more. It seemed to me as if I was in the lap of nature. I was on the top of the world. There was no any traffic jam, no hustle and bustle of busy city. Everything was quiet. It was such a pleasant feeling. Then I realized I just walked 10 kilometer away from my hotel. I rushed back to my place, but the experience was marvelous, which I can't forget. So this is my simple answer. Hope it is very easy and it is in a very simple language. There are some words, vocabs, which are also written in a simple language. If you find anything in difficult, then you can replace those words. OK, so let's move towards the follow ups. OK, so here is a list of follow ups. The first question is, 
what outdoor activities do people like what outdoor activities do people like what are the differences between the outdoor activities children did in the past and now now this is the comparison question so try to be very precise with your answer is leisure important to everyone and why do women have more leisure than men try to speak answers of these questions if you find any difficulty please write it on the comment section i will provide the answer of any question which you want so this is all about my today's video hope you enjoy it thank you bye bye have a nice day